Yo, what's up everybody? Time for a new video. Now today I'm kind of stoked because I just picked up uh, two new weight plates. Picked up two of these. This, uh, they're 10 pounders and these are my old 10 pounders. So as you can see, quite a difference in size. So you see the difference right there. I really like the way these feel and look. They're easier to wield around and so forth. This design I wasn't the biggest fan of, but I bought this during COVID when the beginning of COVID weights were real expensive because all gyms were closed. So people were buying weights to work out at home. And a 10 pounder was going for about 40 bucks, 35, 40 bucks. And this brand, this specific design, I guess nobody wanted to buy these. So these were going for 12, but anything like this or the waiters or any of these other brands, they were going for about 40. So I was like, you know what, I just want to save money. So I went with these. Now that the prices are kind of back to normal, I got this at 12. So yeah, you see, so I got it about the same price as I had these. So I got this for uh, about two of them. So that was 25 bucks. Very happy and stoked with that. That just shows I'm um, getting progress on the bench. So time to buy a few more plates and throw some more weight on there. All right, so that's what we're working right now. I got these 25 pounds, this one and this one are the same brand. So those are the ones I bought when COVID started just to get started. And then ever since I bought these other two, I really, like I said, I really like this brand. I almost want to replace all of these and just get out this brand. Cause I'm, I'm weird like that. I like everything to be in suit, like to match. Like with my books, I do the same. I like freaking scorching. I'm, I'm sweating my ass off just talking right here. And I haven't even got to the workout yet. Now I threw this plastic bag under my shirt. I'm going to throw a sweater on right now so I could get even more hotter. I'm trying to burn some calories, uh, shred a few pounds. You know what I'm saying? Now, um, here, at least on my phone, it says we're at 97 degrees in Southern Cal. You know, that's not completely accurate. You know the way this technology is, but it gives you a rough estimate of where we're at, right? So stay hydrated. All right, I'm also gonna throw a sweater on over this. I might just do a few sets of weights just to kind of check out with the new added weight how I feel. Maybe do two or three sets. I'm not having no specific number of reps. Just gonna do them and um, I'm gonna start trying to work out on my shoulders. So I'm gonna do some of these, whatever you call these. All right, so let's get to it. about 40 bench with a new weight and I also try to do these but I think I'm gonna have to put a little less weight to start with and move my way up to the weight I have on them right now right now I have what I would curl which is about 50 pounds on each side right like or uh, 45 pounds on each side so it's about 90 pounds so I think I'm gonna have to drop it to 35 on each side and and then work my way back up to 45 right so right now I'm just hopping the shower and uh, weigh myself in see where we're at and I'll get back to you guys all right, man, time to check the scales real quick. See where we're at today. There we go, 176.8. All right, so you guys saw we just hit the scale, 176.8. Hopefully, we can get down to like 170 with the scorching heat. I think we could do it before the month ends, right? That's just about six pounds. We should get there, um, and what am I throwing on after the shower, in case you guys are curious, and some Carolina Herrera 212 VIP for men. Look at this wonky bottle. It's a cool magnetic cap, but every time I open it, look, it takes the whole top off. Ah, quality control. This should be glued on better. I could probably glue it myself. You know, once you snap it on, glue it, it should be this way. This should come off by itself. Okay, so anyways. Ah! Nice coconut smell with some lime. Now it smells very tropical, almost like a coconut moisturizer or hand lotion. Uh, it smells good in the summer, but I've noticed in this high heat of the 90s, I've been getting close to three hours, maybe two and a half. It's really volatile and disintegrates quick. And normal heat, like in the 70s or 80s, it lasts me a good five hours. So the 
how long it lasts, the performance really suffers in this high heat. Something in case you guys are interested in checking that out. Just giving you my vague description of the scent. So got these new Ray-Bans because my old ones broke. They look completely different, the design and so forth. Oh so yeah, that uh, pound and a half, two pounds, I worked really hard to sweat off. I'm gonna go order me uh, some Starbucks and maybe grab me a donut and gang that motherfucker right back. All right, check yous out next time.